Hey, what's up everyone? It's your boy Dejer here and today we're gonna be doing a solo five star uh, Gigantamax Gengar raid. It's gonna be really fun. I have a great Obstagoon moveset I think you all you will all enjoy. So without further ado, let's get into it um, Now this moveset or this Gigantamax Pokemon was actually requested. So thank you so much for the uh, you know Recommendations on Gigantamax Pokemon you want to see me take on and if you have any other recommendations Definitely feel free to comment down below um, So yeah, we're gonna be running a life orb on this obstacle same as we did for our excavalier uh with the gardevoir raid so we got that uh 30 damage uh boost with the you know take away from some health definitely worth it uh we are running 252 evs on our obstacle's hp 252 on attack and then uh, i think four on special defense yeah four on special defense nothing on speed uh, and we actually have the hidden ability defiant on this obstagoon here which boosts the pokemon's attack stat sharply when its stats are lowered because uh you know raid pokemon always lower our stats it sucks so defiant's gonna help out a lot you don't need defiant obviously but it's just gonna give us that extra boost to take this thing down uh even more quickly um and now notice that we have 226 speed and we don't have evs and speed uh that's gonna be really good because we're gonna be running the move payback and this user stores powers then attacks if the user moves after the target this attacks power will be doubled so it'll be do a output of 100 power and then we also are a dark type pokemon off is normal dark uh so it's gonna give out a 1.5 times output so it's gonna we're gonna be doing a lot of damage uh with payback uh, Assuming that Gigantamax Gengar definitely outspeeds uh, our obby here. <laughs> and then um, we have Throat Chop on this set as well, or on this Mon, excuse me, as well. Just for when we do Gigantamax, we're going to hit it with that super effective Dark type move. Uh, and I have Thunder Wave here and Bulk Up just for some placeholders. We'll try to get like a T Wave off uh, and slow this thing down, maybe. I probably won't, honestly. I'll probably just go for the paybacks. Uh, but yeah, these are just move slot fillers. But definitely Throat Chop from uh dynamax payback from when we're just trying to take this thing out when we revert to normal form uh we are running obstagoon just because the dark type uh super affects ghost and then ghost doesn't hit normal types and you know poison types are just pretty neutral um towards this pokemon so yeah that's pretty much it let me know what you all think and of course we're dynamax level 10 but yeah let me know what you all think about this pokemon and without further ado let's let's run it up let's push our luck and see what we can do so don't invite others solo raid and let's get into it five star solo raid uh gigantamax gengar if you are hype make sure you hit like and if you are new here make sure you subscribe with notifications on and if you are subscribed Make sure you got those notifications on because yeah we're doing videos every single day my pants are still too big for my character um but yeah here we go gigantamax gengar looking so dope um really like his design it looks like a big old bouncy house and then yeah so we set out our obstagoon and it seems like the theme we got going here is just to always dynamax right off the bat uh because our teammates get taken down as soon as um you know as soon as we get the second dynamax turn uh, you know the second way of being able to dynamax so yeah we're definitely going to dynamax right away and we're going to go with the max darkness um this is a dark type attack that lowers the special uh defense stat whatever it doesn't even matter uh, all we care about is getting the damage off on this thing as quick as possible i mean we have a wishy-washy we have a grass user i didn't see the other uh mon on our side but they probably have some special attacking moves they'll be using on this gengar so i guess it'll help out it's cool um but yeah we're just focusing on that you know Stat, we're doing a stab move and we're doing a super effective move so we have a 2.5 times boost from all the modifiers um you know just from using a dark type move on this gengar which is going to be super dope um super effective gengar is getting desperate okay so now it puts up his gauges um mysterious barrier and then here we go with our max darkness I, okay wow that did so much damage yeah i'm telling you so we got a 2.5 modifier boost which is so dope g max terror um will that affect us uh, is g, what is g max terror is that a ghost move uh gengar use payback oh my god it's just targeting clefairy but it's not very effective uh we got the aqua tail i, I think that is aqua tail i don't know if it's a physical or a special move but not aqua tail and we broke that thing's gauges down really really quick man gengar's design is so dope look at like the smoke in his mouth bro he probably got some hot ref all right um so yeah i was just gonna go with another max darkness here and let's see what we can do uh, this thing's gonna sucker punch us or the cactus dude uh maractus <laughs> uh and then we're gonna use our max darkness boom yeah we took a lot away from that thing so is this gauge just gonna go up yet 
it might it might not go up yet yeah there it goes oh i forgot we had the um forgot we had the life orb on this thing too uh like a, we have so many so we have a 2.5 mod uh modifiers being this the super effective the stab move and then we have a 30 percent boost in our attack with the life orb oh my god um and for the hp we put in this thing as well i should have mentioned earlier um we have a lot of evs in the hp just because it's you know this uh, obstacle has amazing hp 780 overall right now in dynamax um and it's going to be able to take some damage from this life orb like this is going to be our third life orb um attack and we're still in the way 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 in the green here oh my god <laughs> that's why we run life orb that's why we run obstagoon oh my god yeah so we just took that thing out so so quick uh we're gonna catch this thing let's catch it in a um let's catch it in a, oh my god just force guy let's catch it in a uh, ultra ball holy cow uh hopefully we actually do get this thing uh so yeah pray for me here we go ultra ball man okay this might this might be a little crazy let's go all right one two Oh my god, I thought it was gonna break three. Yup, that's how it's done. That's how it's done. Gigantamax Gengar solo max raid battle 100% solo. Uh, that's a five star. Let me move my stinky little camera out of the way. Boom, five star. Y'all already know. Let me get my let me get the border back around my cam. But yeah, you know, we got what do we got? Some store power trick, ally switch, shadow ball. Uh, some stuff to sell a kelpsy berry i think that's a ev berry some dynamax candy and some candies to level up our pokemon so yeah i'm telling you this obstacle strategy is definitely definitely good um we didn't even get out of dynamax which is an awesome thing we didn't even get out of dynamax we were able to destroy that thing in three turns and we actually got some good allies as well uh which is really dope uh so let's actually take a look at this gengar now but yeah the allies definitely play a big role um, Gardevoir is still definitely the hardest Pokemon so far. Uh, here it is. Check summary. So, let me give you guys a little more in depth. So, this thing has Cursed Body, may disable a move used on the Pokemon, and it has eight uh, gauge slots. So, I think Dynamax Pokemon always have eight. Um, and then we, what it's running? What is it running? Nightshade, Sucker Punch, Payback, and Dark Pulse. So, this thing's mostly running Dark type moves. And they're, oh wow, so two physical moves and a special move. And, oh, two special moves and two physical moves. That's interesting. Okay, so yeah, that can definitely give you some some insight um, into this thing. Let's see what nature it is. Uh, calm nature, obviously. You can see I did the uh, the exploit method here um, before, I, before it got patched. Hopefully it gets patched before the Snorlax thing so we can actually grind that out. But yeah, I'm really uh, I'm really excited to do that, that Snorlax raid as well. That got announced, uh, that got announced, um, what to call it Wednesday so that's really dope but anyways yeah so I think off is definitely definitely a really good Pokemon in eighth generation a lot of people are sleeping on off it has a bunch of potential um, it has an, uh, other really good uh, abilities just not even for raiding not even for raiding excuse me but just for like competitive so I realize a lot of people don't even care about competitive they just want to get strong raid Pokemon so uh, what I was doing was making kind of EV spreads and move sets that could be used for both for competitive and for raid battles. But this is more for a raid battle. Um, this set, I mean, you can take this online too, but there are probably more optimal EV spreads uh, for online battling. Uh, you could probably just look them up, but yeah, this is pretty decent. Uh, just 252 HP, 252 attack, and just a bunch of cool stuff. Um, but yeah, Throw Chop definitely came in clutch. Uh, and then if we did on Dynamax, we would have just ran payback. Uh, but like I said, we we got our three turns in there, so that was really dope. And uh, Defiant would help out tremendously. I the text goes by so fast, I have my animations off. I don't even know if Defiant uh, was even a thing. Uh, to be honest, did Defiant even come in? I didn't even realize. But it, whatever. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, Dynamax Gengar. Dragantamax Gengar, excuse me. Why don't we use this guy? Do I want to use this guy in a, in a bat? Let's use him in a raid. I never use the Pokemon in raids. Let's go find a raid. And let's go actually use this Gengar. I should start doing this. <laughs> let's see. Where? Because, yeah, I never used him before. Do I have a raid? Okay, I have a raid over here. Let's go. Let's go. Stony Wilderness. Womp. I, I feel bad for whatever this thing is that we are about to interact with. <laughs> All right. Oh my god, look at that Grimstar. 
uh 2000 watts oh dang okay you guys ready don't invite others some trainers will join the battle we're about to go crazy with this uh gigantamax gengar we just caught let's see what we can do i actually never used a gigantamax pokemon before on my side oh he do be tapping though mr rhyme do be tapping so let's see oh uh, caught that thing in the ultra brawl you already know uh i've got the schooling now i do want to see something is what is um gengar cerebi is curse body gengar's hidden ability like did we get a hidden ability gigantamax mon nope it only has curse uh curse body okay that would be cool our fight dynamax and g max terror on this thing um let's see 100 power 120 yeah we'll go we'll go with g max power just because we have the same type attack bonus move so let's see i'm excited let's see what we can do to this little mr rhyme now we are only level 55 uh and this is with no ev training no stat boost no nothing uh we're just gonna be taking this thing down which is pretty dope oh dang yo this thing is beast dang big got weird tongue going on mr rhyme tapping away he's like not phase he's like i don't care i'll do what i want oh that did nothing <laughs> oh, oh no mr rhyme bro mr rhyme <laughs> I just wanted to see how that would do in battle, but oh God. Okay. Well, I just wanted to see the animation and it on my side. I don't think you guys care about me taking this whole thing down. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope you're enjoying this series. Uh, if you have any more suggestions for Pokemon you want me to uh, do guides on, let me know down below, leave a comment down below and I'll be glad to cover it. Uh, I actually would rather cover suggestions than things I come up with. So yeah, please uh, feel free to keep suggestions and I'm going to put the moose set uh, down below. I'll put uh, pages to Cerebi on all the Pokemon we used uh, and went against being Gengar down below as well. And any other details I may have forgotten or oops, remembered about. So yeah, my name is Deja. Thank you guys so much for watching. I freaking love you. Thank you for 1,100 subscribers. And I'll see you on the next one very soon. Peace. <laughs>